Let's start with just going to look really quickly at some ways of moving graphics from fireworks over to flash. So um, we'll look at moving some of these trees here. Um, to select things in fireworks you've got a couple of options. Usually the best are this one, the marquee tool or the magic wand tool. Um, if you want to use the magic wand you can just click um, on a shape and it mainly involves changing this tolerance value so if you set it right down to zero um, it'll only basically select the color um, only the color that you've clicked on the magic wand the more you increase it um, sort of the more colors will basically it's looking for a match how close is this color to that color and to that color and so on so um, maybe move the tolerance up a little bit more and you can see sometimes it starts to get a bit funny um, so for a shape like this one, it's probably we're probably better off using the marquee tool. Just one more thing with the magic wand. If you hold down the shift key while you do it, you can actually select a bit more. So say you want to grab these bits and grab that bit. If you're just holding down the shift key, you can keep the selection you've got but add to it. Um, similarly, if you hold the alt key, you can sort of subtract from the selection. So yeah, so that's using the magic wand. Um, so to use the marquee tool, which we'll do, to, let's grab this tree here. Uh, you select it and then get the crosshair and just clicking up. Um, and it's pretty easy. To, like, I think the fastest way to get it into Flash is just to copy and paste it. So um, to go copy, just make sure you've got here the, um, the layer selected, which this graphic is actually on, so that's right. Uh, it's on, contained on this main sheet here, on this one. So I'm just Control C and switch over to Flash and Control V. And we'll think about it for a little bit. And then you should get a uh, prompting asking you how you'd like to import this bitmap. So. Okay, um, you usually just want to do this import as bitmap to maintain appearance and oh, if you've got text, probably won't have text, but if you do, you can import that as a bitmap or keep the text editable. Um, but yeah, usually just, it's just a matter of selecting this one, and which it will do by default anyway. And say OK, and it's copied it in fine, um, but a couple of things to note, it's Brought, probably it's brought in a, a white background on it too. For instance, if we change this background color to to green or something, see, it's still got the that white bit around it there, which we don't want. So, um, better way to do it. Going back to fireworks, if we just keep the selection here, I'm going to copy it again. So, Control C, and then to say File, New, and um, create a new document because we just copied something the width and the height of this document will be the same size as what the uh, the error of whatever we just copied so I'm going to click OK and paste it and then I'm just going to zoom in um, now I'm going to just get rid of this white um, bit that's around the tree so use the magic wand for that so just click um, see it's selected just the white region with the magic wand so delete it and delete the other side and I'll zoom back out. Okay, and then just click once, usually with the marquee. If you've ever got a selection, just to, to work with it again, just to get rid of it, just select the marquee, click once, and that'll deselect everything. Now at the black arrow, I'm just clicking on the picture, so Control C, and just going to copy it into or paste it into Flash again. You'll see now it doesn't have that white background, which is what we want. Um, just one thing to be aware of with the library. When you import things from Fireworks, it creates this folder called Fireworks Objects and then a folder called Copy and eventually in here we'll have the, um, the actual stuff that we want. Usually you just want the bitmap, just the bitmaps, so having all these folders that it creates can be a bit of a pain, so the best thing is to just drag them just out of the folder. So I'm just dragging down the bottom and gets rid of that, because all we want is that bitmap and that bitmap, in fact we don't want that bitmap. So and then the rest of it I'm just going to delete and then there we've got our tree there so if you double click it in the library you can rename it so let's 
call that something like tree one. But um, yeah, that's the basics of moving stuff from fireworks over to flash.